You ready to go to the party, Sam? I want to go to the party. You're about to be so high society. Oh my god, I need the practice. <laughs> <laughs> I want to go to the party. This is my favorite. <laughs> we'll just leave him there. He'll be fine. I can't imagine that's comfy, though. But, like, my favorite part of any stealth game is stuff like this. <laughs> okay. Waking up, waking up in a prison cell surrounded by other men, just another day in the life of Anton Sokolov. <laughs> wow, he parts that boat so smooth. Why do you keep trying to butter me up? Tyrant, huh? If you wish to get some sleep, now you just like have Martin follow you everywhere you go. Are are you two together? What? Probably not. <laughs> Perfectly plausible. It, it is. It could be. We're very open-minded here. Except for the really annoying Ruby fan base. <laughs> Which is why I do not associate with them. Seriously, like, I stopped following one of their Facebook pages because I it was like after one of the episodes in season three released. And there was like a long rant post on like, after this episode, I'm fully convinced that Ruby is a lesbian. <laughs> Who cares? And it was just like, at that moment, I'm like, okay, I'm done. I'm just, I'm, I'm just gonna stop following this page. Who cares? Maybe she is, maybe she isn't. It doesn't matter. Like, all I'm saying is her personality, romance is not a thing. Yeah, no, she's just, right now. she's a goofy little kid, and she's annoying as frig. It doesn't matter. It could become the next season. Whatever. I don't care if she's a lesbian or not. I just think, like, speculating on a 14, 15 year old is just, like, pointless. Good girl, Emily. You're welcome. <laughs> now I'm gonna go interrogate a dude. Don't drink my whiskey! You know how she gets with the whiskey. And no one look at me while I use my superpowers. Uh, there's a note on his door. Find me. We'll get back to him. If you need me, find me. The outsider walks among us. I hate you. He's okay. God damn unbreakable doors. I believe you and Corvo knew each other. Unlike you, our friend Corvo knows. Still buttering me up. I am loyal to my inner spirit. You are the one who is sorting the most wanted man in the Empire. Well, he's not wrong. Don't let me shoot you, boy. Ha! <laughs> ha! You wouldn't kill anyone. How can sleep guard him? <laughs> You're out. I'll go buy more! <laughs> And I warn you, my willpower is quite a legendary. I'm bring him beer. No, no joke. That's how we do it. I know. I remember. <laughs> my willpower is quite extraordinary. What if I bring you really nice brandy? Oh, crap. Well, or in that whiskey. Case. I shall bring you whiskey. Whiskey is obviously the solution. See? If we could have found the whiskey, we could have avoided all of this. <laughs> God damn it. Everyone knows sewer whiskey's the best whiskey. Oh gosh. <laughs> you 
You don't drink, you wouldn't know. You suck. <laughs> he just like rubbed your face all over the chain instead of grabbing it. Wait, where is? Oh, okay, okay. The moment when Corvo goes full cat. <laughs> the outsider's getting to him, man. Yeah. <laughs> God, that's going to be, like, the goal of the next game. I want to play as Emily just for, like, the full-on badass Corvo moments that we'll see. Because we saw in the trailer, there's a moment where he's straight up fighting, like, five dudes in the throne room. That might be when you play as Corvo, though. Not sure. The whole game could be in first person. Wait. What the heck? That man is magic. He's uh... in the walls! He lives in the walls. We need to remember this layout. I know, it's important. Uh. I know it looks... I was inventing a new kind of lock. The tumblers... Shit. <laughs> <laughs> you're I really, mean... You're really bad at lying, bro. The truth is that actually kind of makes sense, though, if you think about it. Callista's in her bath, bro. Uh, you watch the bathtub is none of my concern. I, I don't care. I couldn't bear it if she knew. I know you're a man of honor, and I also know that you can kill me. <laughs> she could probably hear us talking out here. And the other one's like, I know what you were doing. Yep. Come here. It's well known that Sokolov is virtually addicted to a rare liquor called King's It's brandy. brandy. He needs whiskey, son. But I haven't had a bottle. However, I am reluctant to give it to you for Sokolov. It cost me quite a lot. I'll, remember when you just said I could kill you really easily? <laughs> <laughs> you don't want to know where you'll wake up after I sleep, don't you? And a drop of whale oil. Ew. Well, here's the catch. You have to buy sleep darts from him. Dun, dun, dun. And you can get your boot stealth. That's not that expensive. Yeah, I know. Uh, I and think it's at the bottom. Boots were made. Oh, there it is. Reduce footstep sounds. And you can get the second one after. Which what's You cannot hear me. You're a step closer to being as quiet as I am. This isn't a joke. Like, my footsteps don't make noise. It's kind of scary. I sneak up on people unintentionally. A lot. You saw nothing. Though I... It might make you happy to know I'm not as good at pickpocketing as I used to be. <laughs> Okay, remember, was it you or Ben that I took your wallet out of their pocket? I think it was Ben, because my wallet's super fat. <laughs> Ass. My wallet's thin. <laughs> Why does he stroke it before he hands it to him? <laughs> he wanted a sip, clearly. I didn't know any more existed. Wait, why did we hand it to him? Where, did he, put, where did he just <laughs> put it? <laughs> just absorbs it into his body. I heard she has a nice ass. No, no, it's getting to that. <laughs> what an ass. Oh, it's okay. We still uh, found an invitation to that party earlier. I mean, I wear a mask. Of course, you already have a mask. Granted, not everyone who's seen your mask has died. You'll be able to mingle with the most relevant. Actually, doesn't make a difference. <laughs> I've, I killed less one, less people in my actual playthrough. If you do this tonight, you'll be able to strike at the Lord Regent himself and put him in I give props to you for, like, how quickly you can plan this stuff. Where I never 
saw her face. <laughs> You know what this means. We gotta find that ass. So I gotta tell. So the first time I, after hearing that, the first time I played this coming level, I was looking at the sisters trying to find which had the nicest butt. I'm like, maybe that's a clue that you know they're all the same model. So of course that didn't work, and I felt like such an idiot. Find the one with the nicest bottom. Ah! I, I legitimately thought there'd be something like that. You alcoholic. He has the whiskey. This man knows good whiskey. Know it's probably super expensive. Good whiskey. This is so funny when you pay the letter to that guy. I don't remember. Now this is funny too. Of course. Did you ever see pirates? And did you sleep me? Sea of pirates. Sea of thieves and. It's okay, she could probably kick your ass. <laughs> Emily, you are adorable. I knew it. I read that some pirate ships have witches aboard that can cause storms and make whales do what they want. Is that true? Yeah. Uh mostly. <laughs> Maybe we should be quiet now. Very well. Wow, you are obedient. Emily, you are adorable and I love you. Oh, that was a belt. I thought it was like a marker on his back telling you to talk to him. No. You cannot break the space-time continuum. Consider seeing I did that in uh, Metal Gear Solid 3 and they got mad at me. I got shiznit, bro. No, really, there's a point in uh, Metal Gear Solid 3 when you're fighting one of the bosses where, uh, oh, I forgot his name, the gunslinger dude. He's, like, up at the top because it's, like, when you play his big boss, so he's a lot younger, and you can shoot him and kill him. And then it, like, comes up with the game over screen with the general going, Snake, what have you done? You've broken the space-time continuum. Wait, Snake? really? Snake! <laughs> That's sick. Because <laughs> I noticed he had a health bar, and I'm just like, oh. I'll just end this now. <laughs> I know you're the bad guy in the future. It's fantastic. Oh, dear God. So much words. So many fonts. <laughs> I don't know why that made me laugh. Now you know what to do, right? Throw a grenade, then wind blast it. All the stops for the boy, family. I didn't think they'd be tall boys to throw it why are you shooting them? What did they do? Okay, guys, target practice. Here we go. Wait, where did he go? He fell off, but there was no shadow falling down that far. He disappeared. Probably disintegrated. Angry fish, angry fish. God, angry this fish, place is a fish. pain to navigate, too. At least from what I remember, I ended up running circles around it for like 10 minutes. It's like when I hunt Pokemon. Also, I had never gotten the invitation from the safe, so I actually had to like go hunt down an it's invitation. It's not hard. Someone just drops one. Yeah, I know. I remember doing it, though. Come on, come on, come on. Blink, please. I think you're even going the wrong way. I am, but I can. you can blink across. I'm trying to do that to avoid the tall boy. I hate those things. Come on. Come on. <sighs> Wait, can I just... Yes. Uh, okay. Why did you think this would be an issue? It's okay, we have quiet footsteps. We can just go. Dun 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 dun. You Super stealth. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh god! The, oh, the zombies! Ah! Ta -da! Are they still following? I don't think they follow very far. Wait, Something's what? Rats! 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 I accept my fate. <laughs> <laughs> Everything went wrong. 